Hello guys, it's Tracker Man. Shout out to everybody out there, man. Subscribe to the channel if you are new, man. Leave a like, leave a comment, hit that notification, and let's get into this, man. So today we're gonna talk about the um yeah third game of the Euros, man. The first game of Group B, uh, we have Spain, Espanol versus uh, Croatia, man, which is gonna be a very good matchup, man. Uh, the last time these two teams played each other, man, Spain won both of those games. So Spain coming to this one um on a on a good. Um, I mean, yeah, I mean, good spirit, I, yeah, I mean, yeah, I mean, good form, whatever. Um, but yeah, man, they have the upper hand because they beat them twice last time, and um, yeah, man, so Spain ranked eighth in the world, and uh, Croatia ranked 10th. Yeah, I mean, there's not like a lot of difference between these two teams, these two teams are good, that's all I gotta say, bro. Both of them are good, and both of them are world, these men. Spain won the Euros, they won the World Cup, they're pretty much yo, at one point, Spain was unstoppable, bro, in the um, Barcelona days, when Barcelona used to run stuff, and that's the thing between um, between um, Barcelona and Real Madrid, uh, Barcelona made um, Spain better, while Real Madrid just made themselves better, you know what I'm saying, Barcelona was good, but they had nothing but like a lot of Spanish players, while Real Madrid right now is just dominating, bro, and it's just like a few really good Spain, it's a few good Spain players, really, to be correct, um, but yeah, man, they probably have the better sp Spanish player than, than Barcelona right now, not gonna lie, but it is what it is, uh, so let's get into this, man, so yeah, man, uh, the last five games for, uh, Spain has been one loss, and, um, uh, forgot who the loss to, one loss, one draw, they drew versus, uh, Brazil, 3-3, three, three. and, uh, yeah, man, one loss, one draw, and three win, they're coming off a two-game winning streak right now, um, they beat, who they beat, they beat, uh, I believe, um, they beat, beat two small, uh, two weak teams, bro, uh, scoring 10 goals in both of those games, um, so yeah, five goals, each, sorry, they scoring five goals in both of those games, and, uh, last, what, three games for them, they scored nine, uh, 13 goals, conceded four, uh, goals, man, so it, it, it's crazy, bro, they, they, they scoring goals for fun, man, uh, they brought in a few guys, I forgot his name, bro, I'm not gonna lie, he has been on fire, bro, so, yeah, man, um, they've been very, very good, man, so, uh, shout out to Spain, bro, they, they are probably right, though, when it comes to scoring, they are a problem, um, and, uh, yeah, man, Croatia has been great, bro, Croatia has been great, undefeated in, the, in their last five games, they also on a, uh, they on a three game winning streak right now. So the past five game for them has been uh, four wins and one draw. I believe they drew with Tunisia. Uh, they beat Egypt and I forgot who they beat recently, bro. But yo, they on a roll. Right? They beat Portugal, bro. Portugal didn't have Ronaldo, but like yo, they've been playing some fantastic football. Magic came back in the squad. They he scored a um, a, um, a penalty, but like yo, everybody has been stepping up and they have a very good team overall, man. They're freaking left back that played for City. Uh, Gordeviol, whatever his name is, bro, he's a monster, bro. Like, yo, the, the, yeah, this Croatian team is very good. And the thing I like about Croatia is, like, they have generation talent. Like, they have old guys and they have young guys, bro. It's like the talent just keep rotating, and that's how you keep a good team, bro. Like, you you have guys that comes up, and once they fade away, the team go to trash. But these guys, the old guys out, the new guys come in, and it's just the same, bro. It's still quality. So, uh, for this game, I'm going with the Croatia to win this one, at least a 2-1 win. Uh, minimum of a 2-1 win for Croatia. I think both teams will score BTTS. Uh, yes. And, uh, yeah, man, uh, Croatia to score at least 1.5 goals. The game to be over 2.5 goals. And at least uh, 9 corners, at least 8.5 corners for this game. And so, yeah, that's my prediction. What you guys think, man? Uh, leave a like, leave a comment. And, uh, yeah, I'm out of here, though. Peace.